Hey YouTube, um, reminder if you want a lesson with me, check the link in the description. Missed the mouthpiece that time. Anyway, I am now 30 years old. Yes, that's correct. I am super old and my hair is super duper long. This is the longest it's been since I was like 19. It's been a long time and it's not getting shorter anytime soon. Anyway, let's move on to the subject of today's video not long tones. So I think my previous video, I kind of ragged on everyone talking about long tones is the best way to get a better sound of trombone. I don't disagree. I think uh, long tones are a way to get better at sound of trombone. Not my top priority though. So some people were like, well, if we're not working on those, what should we work on? Guess what? I finally remembered something um, that other than the obvious like slurs and scales and things, this is something that I have known about for a long time that I got from a friend of mine that I just constantly forget to do and it's a really great exercise and it's really, really simple. Put on a metronome at some tempo. This is my tempo, it's 125 today. And play one minute of a note. Etc. That's pretty much it. That's the whole exercise. Um, I've been doing it with a drone. I'm pointing behind me because I put a Bluetooth speaker on the floor behind me um, for my drone. I don't like to put it up here because it actually doesn't sound as good. Um, and I use my phone for that, so I can't do it right now. But I'll put the drone on for whatever note I'm playing. It doesn't have to be the same octave. Sometimes I do an octave higher. Um, and that just, that means I can close my eyes and just listen and keep it in tune. Otherwise I have to kind of stare at the tuner and just kind of center every single one of those. Um, and I put the metronome on. And it doesn't have to be this tempo. I've chosen 125 because I've been working on triplets, um, which could give you another variation on this. It doesn't have to be just eighth notes. It could be slower articulations, it could be faster. <laughs> Um, and you just play that for a minute. Are you playing for an entire minute straight with no breaths? No. Um, breathe whenever you need. It doesn't matter really at all. You're really just going for a lot of consistent articulations on the same note. And you can hear, even in mine, I've just been practicing this much. doesn't matter. They're not perfect. Every once in a while there's a little da 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 The tongue will get kind of stuck up. Uh, you'll hear the pitch go woo, woo, woo. Um, the sound might go da 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 It'll kind of change sometimes. And what I want is that to be all as even as possible. Just have one constant stream of the same note over and over again. Um, and this is basically, guess what? It is a long tone, but you have that whole dimension, which is a pretty large dimension, of articulating that note over and over and over and over again. Um, and that forces you to keep the air moving the whole time. The way that a long tone, you should move the air the whole time, but it's really easy not to, which is the reason I kind of shy away from those, especially with younger students. Because um, it's really to kind of easy to make a really unsupported small sound that is perfectly in tune and in time and all that stuff, but is not what we're going for with a good trombone sound. And this forces you to Da, 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 move the air so the tongue can move in a nice, consistent way. Of course, you can do this in different registers and uh, obviously different tempos, but different registers, um, say you're really uncomfortable with high uh, F sharp. This is going to be awful. That's pretty inconsistent. I can feel it getting better, even just in the you know 15 seconds that I just did it. I can feel my face, my tongue, the oral cavity kind of going, oh, this is how we should do this to make this the most efficient way possible. Instead of just kind of da, 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 or whatever you're doing. You can do this low as well. I'm not gonna do that, I don't wanna embarrass myself. Um, you can do this on any instrument. This is just super handy way to check in. I guarantee if you do this on just a couple notes every day, it doesn't even have to be for a minute. 
you're gonna find your playing in that range specifically to be a lot more efficient. So check it out. Um, I think this is a really good way to work on a lot of things at once in a really simple way. Use the drone, use a metronome, use your ears, use your eyes, use your hands. I don't know, use a bunch of stuff. And that's all I got. See you guys next time.